Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. I know it's been um, way too long since I put a video up here but I have been on vacation and it was really good. It was a breath of fresh air and I'm happy to say that I'm back. This is the first time that I'm recording a video with a friend of mine behind the camera. Her name is Simone Sandwich and she actually has started her YouTube channel so don't forget to check it out. What is the YouTube channel called? Felinke Noir. And if you didn't understand that, that's okay because neither did I. So um, I'll leave that in the description box below. So I know that right now you're probably looking at the name of this video and thinking, yeah, we are nearly at the end of February, but it's better late than never. So I thought I would do my January favorites and let you guys know what I have been loving uh, in the month that I was around the world. It's not a lot of things, it's a couple of things, but I hope you guys enjoyed this video. So to start off the video, we always start with skincare, as you guys know, and this is not something that I normally used to wear, but I realized uh, from a lot of conversations with girlfriends that it was something that I should start wearing because I am coming to 30. <laughs> it's called a night cream, and it's it's a bummer to have to do because I mean you already have to take off your makeup, you already have to put your um, use your moisturizer again and your turn on this set the other. But um, it's easy if you put it next to your um, bedside table, which is what I do here at home. And so I always remember when I look to my bedside table, oh, I have to put my night cream on. And I hadn't used one before, so I decided to go to where I normally buy my things, just for him. And I got their multi-active night cream, which looks like this. It's really great because the consistency isn't too thick, so when you're about to go to bed at night time, uh, you wash your face, you go to bed, and then you put it on, and it just, it smells amazing, and it kind of uh, leaves your skin feeling really smooth. So I can't tell you if it's worked and miracles on me yet because I started using it in January, but again, it's definitely my skincare favorite for January 2016. I don't know if this is actually skincare or body, but I'm just gonna consider it as body because it helps <laughs> my body smell good. As most of you might know if you read my blog, which is lasonatina.com, L-A-S-O-N-T-A, then lasonatina, ha ha, ha spelling, <laughs> S-O-N-A-T-I-N-A, -A. yay, spell me. <laughs> but anyway, um, brain fart. <laughs> Yes, yeah, so if you read my blog post, um, I wrote a blog post about the perfume that I wear, which is the same one since I've been 15, which is Coco Chanel Mademoiselle, and this Christmas I was given by Miguel's family. They gave me a beautiful um, small version of Coco Chanel Mademoiselle, which is this size. It's actually a 50 milliliter um, pack, which is good because if you travel, which I do, you can always take it with you, so you'll have no problems with you know getting through security and this, that, the other, and it's just, it's not even very heavy and it's great so you always smell good you never know what will happen so having this with you is definitely a plus in my travel life so it was a very good Christmas present and I definitely recommend it especially if you want um, well if you want Coco Mademoiselle <laughs> on to makeup already I told you this video is gonna be short and sweet hopefully um, the, my favorite for makeup this month was definitely something that I stopped using a while ago and then I changed it for other different um, blushes until I realized, no, I actually really like the blush that I used to use before and when I lost it in America, I was like, damn, I gotta buy a new one because I realized I really like it. And it's the Rocketeer by Benefit. I've talked about this before in previous videos, but I haven't found a blush that has done it for me as well as Rocketeer has because um, I don't like uh, blushes that that focus more on the highlighting of the cheekbone and I don't like blushes that are too plummy. I do like the fact that Rocketeer has, whilst it does highlight your cheekbones, it also gives more of a tinted look and I do like the fact that you know I get to have a little bit of a rosy cheek so I don't look like I'm dying. So Rocketeer is definitely um, a favorite and not not really just a favorite of January, it's like a glory item. You guys know I have glory items. And so yeah, um, I definitely recommend this blush if you're, if you don't have a blush that you already like and you're like, you know what Mia, I'm looking for a blush, what would you recommend? I would recommend Rocketeer by Benefit, definitely. This is the first time that I'm going to talk about a brand that I've never used before. I've heard a lot of different people talk about it and you know, I had, I was hesitant because, you know, hair is, at least in my case, my hair isn't the kind of hair that will 
enjoy new brands or sometimes when I try, I'm like, hey, I'm gonna try this. Afterwards, my hair becomes either too dry, too oily. <laughs> Behind me, there's like a war going on with Maka and Simon. But anyway, <laughs> but yeah, my my hair is, normally it's it's a hair that has a tendency to, to be oily and I have a lot, of, a lot of hair, but it's all fine hair. So finding a shampoo that works for me is never an easy task. But I decided to go ahead and try the S Factor Smoothing Lusterizer. Um, I've never tried S Factor before. I've always been uh, intrigued to try it, and I did for the whole month of January. And I've got to say, I don't, I don't think I've been using it enough to be able to say, guys, it's amazing. But I can tell you that it smells great. It leaves your hair feeling smooth. Um, I haven't had. Um, breakouts of oiliness in my hair yet, but then again I do wash it every single day and I am trying hard to find a shampoo that will let that will aid me in not having to wash it every single day because I mean I get it sucks having to wash your hair every single day and then blow dry it and blah blah blah. But until now I'm definitely happy with um, S Factor and it does help for whenever you want because sometimes you don't want those kinks in your hair, sometimes you don't want the fact that you know it curls because mine does. And this one actually helps it stay um, stay straight or aids the the um, the drying of your hair to keep it straight without actually having you know the chemicals that destroy your hair so you know I've got to say positive positive review for the X Factor okay last but not least this month I do not have the book section or the music section I have been on vacation so I haven't well normally if you're on vacation you read but in this case I was very busy and I didn't have time to just kick back and and, and read something so um, I will be saving that for February because I mean I I did read, but I haven't finished the book that I'm reading, so I can't tell you if it's an amazing book or not, so we have to wait for that. But the household section is this that I bought from Mr. Wonderful. It's a brand that I really like, and it's basically like a weekly organizer. It's very cute. I don't know if you guys can see that very well, but it's a weekly organizer that you can buy on their site or online or whatever, where you have Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, you have your weekly um, chores, you have something that says very important, then calls, you need to call this person, you need to write to this person, this one's funny because you don't really write to anyone unless it's an email, and then you have the weekend, Saturday and Sunday, and it's really cute because it gives you like four different moods that you can tick off every single day, and at least in my case, I have different moods in different days, I'm not always like excited or I'm not always like jumping up and down, and sometimes I have moods where I'm like, you know, more serious or more, um, or tired, there's a tired face there, I have that sometimes, so it's great, and I keep it over here on my wall just so that I can write down the things that I want to do in the morning, in the afternoon, at nighttime, and yeah, so it's definitely a, a, a good thing to buy for Mr. Wonderful because besides the fact that it's cute, it also will help you with the organization which will make 2016 much easier. So that was the video of January's favorites. I hope you enjoyed it. If you haven't yet subscribed to my channel, don't forget to subscribe. Uh, new videos will be coming up very, very soon. Don't forget to check out my blog, www.lastsonatina.com. Don't worry if you don't understand what I'm saying because in the description box below, I will write down all the links to all my different sites. Um, so yeah. Also, don't forget to comment in the box below and let me know what other videos you would like to see me doing. I love to read your reviews and your comments and your suggestions, so don't forget to comment in the box below. Also, let me know if you guys want me to do a Stage It show. I haven't done a Stage It show for such a long time, and I kind of just want to get a feel for if that's something you guys would like to see me do, if you want to see me sing, um, what kind of videos you want to see me sing. You know, it's always good to get some kind of help or um, ideas, because sometimes you're just like, what song shall I do next? So yeah, I want to know from you guys, and... Yeah, I love you guys. Big, big kiss.